Hey guys, I'm James Erickson. And I'm Andres Erickson, and welcome back to... We all make mistakes. We're only human. As gamers, we're always eager for something new or something surprising or out of left field. We often grow tired of the old and crave something more. It's in our nature. But in the process, we allow ourselves to fall for fake leaks or rumors of crazy unlockables that seem impossible to achieve. We all fall for this type of stuff, but honestly, it's what keeps the gaming world exciting. Today, in this video, we thought we'd go over some of the fake news or cheats or rumors that we fell for in the past, and then read some of the ones that you've experienced in your past. For the for the first rumor or fake news, <laughs> fake, news. fake news, a lot of the ones that I remember are related to Super Smash Brothers, and yeah, a lot of you who play too. Super Smash Brothers probably can agree and maybe even remember the same ones. And one in particular uh, I do remember is unlocking Toad. When I was younger, it was said that if if you were able to shoot all the oh, names yeah. in the credits, <laughs> uh, you were able to unlock Toad. Yep. And we like we were, we just nobody qu nobody questioned I it. I know. I remember was, that. <laughs> we we didn't like there were internet was different back then. Not mm -hmm. everyone had a phone at their hands to right. look anything up. In fact, neither of us explored the internet until we were probably in middle school and high school. Yeah. Um, and it was very scarce anyways. I remember I would be over at my friend's house and sometimes we would spend, we would go through the adventure mode or the classic mode, I don't remember which one had it, maybe both Yeah, I think did. it was adventure. Oh, maybe they both did, yeah, I don't know. And we would spend just as much effort and time in shooting all the names, getting every coin, I think it was coins you could get by shooting them. Um, I don't know if anyone has ever done it because it's literally, <laughs> I think it's impossible. If you've, yeah. if you've hit every single credit and name on the credits, show us in there, tell us in the comment. Another one that we both fell for was another Smash Bros related one, but it was Smash 64. The rumor is that you could, you could unlock a certain expression for some of the characters. I think the one that I remember was like Angry Eyes for Pikachu and yeah. then something for Link too. Do you remember other ones? Yeah. Those are the two I remember most. I yeah. think I think Ness and Jigglypuff were part of it, but I, oh, I only remember yeah. Pikachu and, and Link mostly. I don't remember how they said you would unlock them, but I was... I, I remember it was you had to <laughs> you had to do very hard on one life. Oh yeah, I do remember that. <laughs> did we ever do that? I don't think we did. No. Oh my really gosh. Hard. I and I tried so often because just like the toad thing, I didn't question it. I just believed yeah. it. <laughs> and so I remember trying to do very hard with one life yeah. and I would get to I think Metal Mario was the farthest I would get if I remember. That's pretty but it was far. hard to get there. So I mean, nobody had YouTube to like fact check these things. We're just like, okay, I guess we're gonna try to find out. Uh, this one is not Super Smash Brothers related. This is actually Mario Kart related, specifically Mario Kart Super Circuit for the Game Boy Advance. Uh, you have a set amount of characters for that game, and I don't, I'm pretty sure I beat the game. So I, even now, I'm still questioning this one. But it was said that you could unlock Waluigi for Mario Kart Super uh. Circuit, which Waluigi Wang. wasn't in Mario Kart 64, and Mario Kart Super Circuit was very close to the way Mario Kart 64 was like same characters and same kind of style I guess uh, But I believed it and I tried it I think it was a friend of mine who just he just lied to me and was like oh, yeah, I have Waluigi and I wanted to see it so bad, but he, he didn't tell me so yeah. And then elementary school you just believe everything. I know people just said things it's like okay <laughs> Sure, <laughs> yeah, the next one I have is kind of recent in the past few years and it's about the switch it's bef it's just, it was a rumor and before or it was it wasn't a rumor it was like a fake leak and before the switch came out it's known as the NX that was like the code name or whatever and there was all these leaks and fake patents and stuff of like what the controller was going to look like and what it was going to be like and you can show it on the screen but there was a picture that came out of like the controller what the controller was going to look like for the NX and it it isn't real but it was like you can see it here. It's like the screen and then the joysticks on the screen and um Oh, the oval one? Yeah. It's like a real real picture, so I don't know who made it, but like were you convinced that that was the actual thing? I don't remember. I think I might have been. Well, I think by the time I saw that, I I think we already knew it was going to look like something else, but I mean, I I might have seen it and been like like, huh. 
All right, the next one is still Super Smash Brothers related. Uh, so Super many. Smash Brothers 64 related. <laughs> Um, because th those are the ones I remember the most from my youngin past. Yeah. And for this one, at school, we, my friends and I would talk about it all the time, Super Smash Brothers, because it's a great game, obviously. It is. Um, some of you guys subscribe to us for our Super Smash Brothers stuff. I'm <laughs> probably asking, why aren't you guys doing more Super Smash Brothers stuff? When are you going to stream um, Super Smash Bros. again? One of my friends told me that you could unlock... Actually, he told me that he unlocked uh, <laughs> Metal Mario and Metal Luigi. Oh, yeah. And, of course, I believed him. Because I was in third or fourth grade. We established he was and, stupid uh, when he was younger. <laughs> yeah, I believed everybody and right. everything. <laughs> and he said that to unlock them, you had to... You couldn't fight them. Or you couldn't fight... Um, was Metal Mario Mario Metal Luigi in that? Maybe it was just Metal Mario. I think Metal Luigi was in it sometimes. I don't remember. Maybe that was just Melee. Gosh, now I can't yeah. remember. Oh, yeah, yeah, it was Melee. Anyways, Melee. He said, he said, if you grab Metal Mario and throw him off, oh the yeah, edge, and he doesn't come back, then you automatically, you automatically win. I remember that. It's funny how unlocking all these people are, you have to do near to impossible things, right? To exactly. Unlock them because so they always remained a mystery, because I could never do it. That should have been a red flag. <laughs> the last one I have for you is. Um, there was, if everybody remembers that, that leak that came out, it was like this fake picture of like a paper, uh, taped to a door of the, what the Switch, the, like the big Switch, Nintendo Switch presentation that happened back in March this year, I think. Was it March? The Switch came out in March. Oh, the lineup for what's coming out, right? Yes. Yeah, but it was like the lineup of what games were going to be talked about, and it was like, let me read some of them here, there was like... And we can show the photo too, but it said, like, Super Mario Frost Land. That was before Odyssey was revealed. And Splatoon Counter Attack. Oh my gosh. I forgot <laughs> it's some, about it's that so list. dumb now because now we know all of them. Mario Kart 8, Switch It! Then <laughs> 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 Super Smash Bros. for Nintendo Switch, yeah, right. Uh... Blah, blah, blah. The Rabbids Invasion. That was because there was a leak of that picture already. But yeah. just stuff like that. And obviously you see that now and it's like, okay, okay, obviously that's not true. But me being an idiot, um, this is what happened. Someone, this kid, like earlier when our channel was a little bit smaller, there was this guy who was like one of our viewers. And I think he played with us a few times, I don't know. But um, he added me on Facebook. He messaged me, he sent me the picture in Messenger and he was like, share this with your channel. And I was like, oh my gosh, what is this? Like, where did you get this? And he was like, my uncle works for Nintendo. <laughs> Which is what other people were saying too with this leak. Because like, I, I don't know if it was, they were acting like it was a joke, but he was acting like he was serious. And he was like, what did he say? He was like, my uncle works for Nintendo. And I was like, are you serious? And he was like, yeah, use it. He was like, just don't say that I sent it. <laughs> <laughs> and he was like, you know how Nintendo is. I was like, oh, yeah, okay, yeah, sure. And I was like, wow, me and James are about to do, like, our predictions for this. So, oh, I got to show this. And then I think I showed you, and you were like, I don't know if this is real. And then I looked it up, and I found it other places. And I was like, oh, wait, people already saw this. I said that to him. And I was like, did you, like, where did you get this? And he was like, just use it. Like, he didn't say anything else. And then she I was just. He back and said, like, you're an outright liar, trash. I know, it was so annoying. It was like, just put that in the video and just say, I, like, don't say I gave it to you. You look like and idiots. I, <laughs> after that, I was like, I was so annoyed when I found out it was fake. I was like, why did you do that? Like, now he, like, he's like messaged me a couple times. I was like, I'm not messaging you back. You betrayed my trust. <laughs> Goodbye. My so goodness. that was kind of annoying, but I was pretty stupid for falling for that. <laughs> So that's some of the cheats and news and thingy-gibbets that we fell for. Now we're going to read some of yours in reading a viewer comment. Brendan Lowry says, Fake cheat guide I fell for as a kid. In Mario Kart 64 and Royal Raceway, I was told that if you went off the course toward Peach's Castle, you could enter it and drive around inside if you went ah. fast <laughs> enough at a particular part of the castle, and I spent hours trying to get inside. Uh, I remember this. <laughs> oh, Brandon, you silly boy. I remember doing the exact same thing. Navi boy 16. Oh man, I remember looking up the inter uh, on the internet for Super Smash Bros. Melee unlockable characters and seeing that Toad was unlockable if you shot every single credit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I spent a good amount of time trying to do to try my best to do just that. 
That's so funny that someone actually brought that up. So it wasn't (laughs) just like me and my friend thinking about it or talking about it. It was like actually on the internet now that I remember. Or now that Navi confirmed our remembrances. A Richard Orozco says, I fell for a cheat code made by a channel called Ericsson Gaming. Hmm. He's serious. I don't know. Maybe you're joking, Richard. He's joking. Oh, because at the end he said he 100% fell for that. Oh, really? No, yeah. you did. No way, Richard. He said he fell for the one that said he could get an extra life in Smash if he did the moves that I said. So he tried it. And he got the extra life. Guess what? No life. If I knew this Anderson and Eckerson people, I would sue the frack out of it. <laughs> <laughs> LOL. That's what I fell for. 100% fell for that. Sorry, Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Sorry, you don't know what a parody is. The Gamer Players says, The fake guide on unlocking Goku made by some people that I don't know who they were. They were. American Brothers? Ericsson Gaming? (laughs) Oh, you're talking about our parody again. Well, I mean, it wasn't a parody. I have Goku. Guys. Oh, yeah, what are you talking about? It's not fake. You can do it. Go watch the video, guys. Gee. We got him. We have a letter from Sakurai that is real. Sakurai. Flex Cloud says, I haven't really fallen for cheat codes or guides exactly, but one time someone told me, to get to something in game, I had to alt for one of the buttons that shuts down the game. I was too gullible. Oh, I heard about people doing that, like tricking their friends and stuff. Uh, and people online. <laughs> I think tons Sucks. Of people do that. <laughs> yeah, that is really annoying. <laughs> I'm sorry. Just press I'm alt sorry for your loss. And then your computer explodes. <laughs> Domo Fire 13. Somebody, somebody made a video where they uh, made a key to control a guardian in Breath of the Wild. I've been uh, getting the items in the video for 15 minutes, then I realized it was on April 20, uh, April 1st. Actually, oh. <laughs> I saw this video too on April oh, 1st. You did? And I was like, oh my gosh, this is really cool because the video was so well made that if you didn't know any better, it was totally believable. And I believed it for like the first half or the first like three fourths of the video and then i realized like wait a second it's april 1st and other people oh. in the comments and stuff were saying it was fake it's uh, like wait a second it's april 1st and also all the comments are already telling me it's fake mm-hmm. <laughs> yep nintendo nerd says i once thought you could play your wii u games on your ds if you put the disc on top of the ds are you serious who told you that <laughs> or did you just really think that <laughs> dr moomoo 91508 <clears throat> when I was younger, cough, last year, cough, my friend told me that if you played Super Smash Bros. for 100,000 hours and then died by Kirby committing suicide while Sonic taunts in the background on the Pikmin stage, then you would unlock the announcer as a character. Why did I believe this? Are you serious? <laughs> Are you serious, Dr. Moomoo? Get out! Goodness. Just get out! Thank you for your comments. We always enjoy reading your silly little comments. They make us laugh and uh, very insightful and informing to us. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, for next Ericsson Exchange, um, we're going to hit 50,000 subscribers pretty soon, sooner than I thought we were. Um, so by the next Ericsson Exchange, we'll probably be in the 50,000 mark, past that. So we thought, hey, why don't at this point do another Q&A? So um, instead of us asking you a question, why don't you ask us questions? You can ask us any question you want, any question. Like, what's our favorite color? Now, there's a good one. Thank you guys, as always, for watching. Um, Just the fact that we're hitting 50,000 subscribers soon is a pretty cool, uh, just whatever you want to call it. I mean, even by this video, we might have hit 50,000 subscribers. But honestly, it's, it's you guys watching, commenting. Uh, liking our small videos and our very big videos and uh, yeah so thank you Um, and if you'd like more of this and you're not subscribed subscribe to it and follow us also on Twitter uh, and Instagram that's Ericsson Gaming and also on Twitch we'll be streaming more to Twitch more Splatoon I want to start streaming Splatoon to Twitch so if you like Splatoon follow us on Twitch um, and then you can also follow us on Facebook. The link is right here. <laughs> here it is. Or In front of my website, face, yeah. there's the link. Type it at Facebook. Go and like and comment and post our Facebook page to 12 of your friends and tell them to do the exact same thing and tell them to tell their friends to do the exact same thing. Yes. Okay? 
And if they ask Anyways. why, just say, don't ask, and then punch them. Yes. Just kidding. Make don't sure it's a violence. good punch. Wear brass knuckles. If you need to, just kidding. That's a weapon. Don't do that. <laughs> Anyways, on that yeah. note, you all have a great day. Bye. Bye. Bye.